guys we're gonna jump in to episode six a portal to mystery of minecraft story mode i don't know if i'm gonna be completing this game tonight it's three episodes i know episode five is like two hours long as well so i'm not sure Matthew Lillard wasn't in school, but I thought it was still pretty good. On my it's decent for what it was. Glow. I and wish chance. Matthew Lillard it's was in it, though. Very old group of builders, a group so old that they existed even before the Order of the Stone. What a recap. <laughs> Off to a great start. I don't know like what the rest of this game is going to be like. I'm so confused. Okay guys, I'm seeing grass, forests, lots of ground in all directions. All good signs so far. Uh -huh. Did you ever did you ever have Doritos 3D chips back in the 90s? Um I think it's like early 2000s I actually had them, but yes. Told you it was a dumb bet. Oh, who asked you? Oh, come on. Can't you hear it? The spooky forest? It's the sound of a new adventure! I bet this place is gonna be awesome! I hope you're right. I was just... Uh, I'm just worried about Axel and Olivia. What? Why? <coughs> well, if they followed us back to that old builder temple and went through the portal... They would arrive in Sky City to find it overflowing with monsters! Yeah. At least we already built them the bridge. That is more than we started with. Okay, so maybe they did, but they can handle themselves no problem. So but confused at what the rest of this game is going to be. We'll and the fact that there's a season guys. two is fucking scary. Well, I for one vote that we not be so hasty to try and get out of here. Who knows what sorts of treasures this new world could hold. Besides, they launched in 1998. I was two years old when they launched then. I'm not seeing it anywhere near here. They're coming back? Oh shit, are they? You guys see some sort of shape over there yeah what is that let's find out that's fucking dope i'll definitely begin some what doritos did i just try oh the fucking tangy pickle doritos i just tried those like a week or two ago they're actually pretty good i'm so old <laughs> you're not old clumsy it says invitation and then Read immediately, your life depends on it. Ahem. <clears throat> Greetings, traveler. Oh, yeah, that shit. seems about right. Oh, no, 3D hey, bring Doritos. Got your back. You can pre-order them on Amazon I right now. How much are they? My mansion for an evening of food and festivity with your fellow adventurers. That's <laughs> odd. Yeah, weird, right? I lost my V-card in 1996. Damn. <laughs> are you my daddy, clumsy? Yeah, you were born. Oh shit. <laughs> Kill it! Petra, any time now? You can read, right? Hang on, hang on! Maybe. Jesse's place. got it! I mean if it's nineteen ninety six that just follow the You lost your V card, I mean it wouldn't have worked out because I was born in March. Please look out for zombies. Sincerely, the host. Nice warning. Come on! There's the path. I must say, <clears throat> this is the highest concentration of zombies I've ever seen in this one place. Apple drinks, or Earth rings, Sun, and Fire ones. Legit, Not sure I, I remember those. This place hasn't exactly been friendly so far. Hey, Seems legit the to me. Was classy, though. I don't see why they wouldn't be. The invitation and everything seems pretty legit. Thanks for cleaning that up for me, so I don't have to take a DNA test. And say, that's the place we're looking for. 
race you guys there. You haven't been part of my life for oh, yeah. the first 24 years, I clumsy. What the fuck? Bad, bad knees. Hey, just try not to die, okay? I'm trying to keep everyone together here. Sure, sure, that's fine. But you gotta catch me first. I'm having a hard time taking this game seriously again. <laughs> I guess I have to make up for it by buying you a PS7. <laughs> yes! I will love you forever if you get me a PS7. Oh, fuck. Ah! <laughs> he just fucking face planted. I got you, Ivor. That's his name, right? Thought we were gonna kill the bat, too. Like, what the fuck? Oh, we're back to dodging again. What? I'm. There's no need to even jump that. Get him on PC. <laughs> this music is really loud in my headset. Oh good, we're back to this. You spider fuck. You hear that too, right? Almost sounds what, this like music? A... Yeah, I hear it fucking loud and clear. X, 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 X. Oh shit. I can't get him anything because PC GPUs and consoles are out of stock. Excuses. Yo, what's up, Night Wolf? How are you doing? Hate spiders, same. I hate spiders, but I love Spidey. Sex, sex, sex. <laughs> Is this gonna be the whole episode? I was just doing this dodging shit. I mean, I'm down with it. What the fuck is this? Oh, what? I didn't even see that. I didn't see it till it was too late. Any yeah, husband question? I'm listening. Didn't sleep less, but I took a nap today. Well, I hope. He still got a little bit of good rest, Night Wolf. Alright, just chilling as going. Oh, I'm doing alright. Woo! Nailed it! <clears throat> okay, okay. I used to be a Minecraft soldier until I took an arrow to the chest. For Christmas, can you get me butt plugs and I'll get you a sex doll? <laughs> um. definitely a no go. I don't know. <laughs> Stick with me, guys. <laughs> Real thing was a good luck charm in the hydrate. <laughs> oh fuck! Was I supposed to do something there? I'll hydrate in just a second. Today I saw a butt plug with a tail attached. What the fuck? What? What'd you see? I mean, if that's what you really what want, Luna. Ask? I mean, well, like sure thing. Some... Don't know who he was. Some creepy guy in the window. This is a Christian Minecraft surfer, <laughs> Luna. White pumpkin. No Time to ban Luna. Let's save the agricultural discussions for inside, okay? Great! There's no drawback here. How are we supposed to get in? 
<laughs> Andre sips beer. <laughs> what am I doing? Oh. There! We should be able to build up and break in through there. So I have a story for that wolf. Oh god. We can cut those down. He'd <laughs> ban your wife. I mean I'd unban her. <laughs> and now my inventory is full of wood blocks. Hey, you never know when those will come in handy. Looks like there's some kind of kitchen in there. Then break the window and get us into the blasted place. Hope the host doesn't mind. So the last place I worked at was the teen mom's one discharged. So we had to go and clean the room. She left. <laughs> what the fuck? She left so much behind. Oh my god. Wow, some kitchen. You never did. I wouldn't ban you, Luna. Who's this? I think we could avoid a lot of unpleasantness. Uh, what what fucking 1970 right. shit is this? Oh, ha, ha, ha. Very, very funny. Show up super late, make us all sit and wonder what the heck is going on. Now, this is your house, right? Because if it is, we've all been waiting for like hours. It's rude. Now, easy, Torque Dog. We're not the hosts of Wednesday. Torque Dog, huh? Sorry. We're just in here to hide. Did you leave a sex cell for dress? Pretty bad out there. Well, that girl had a butt plug no in the drawer, way. and it had a tail. I no, saw what was in that closet and walked away. And walked away. <laughs> Damn. Dog, sir. And I'm Captain Sparkles. <laughs> so, nope. Uh, I don't blame you. <laughs> already. Captain Sparkles? I've got, like, nine million fans? Captain Sparkles? Are you saying that with a Z? Those are your names? You know you took it. Damn. Uh, yes? Huh. Weird. Anyway. I'm Jesse, that's Petra, Ivor, and Lucas. John. Jesse? That's a boy's name. Careful not to leave certain anyway, stuff behind. Some sort of loser patrol. Fuck dog. Oh, come on. That was hilarious. You would know all about loser patrols, wouldn't you? <laughs> I'm saving this for later. <laughs> Whoa! You fronting right now? Is that what's going on? Well, fun of hand me downs in that department. Got, like, yeah, I fans? mean, I wouldn't want to be cool either. It. That sea of zombies has us all trapped, so we just need to try our best to get along. Worst day ever. Just try and look on the bright side. Hmm. Jesse is a six name. Watch yourself, little dude. Right? Like. <laughs> I tell you what, the minute. My oh, sister's man, name is Jesse, and I know males named Jesse. Like, okay, so the sea of zombies isn't normal. Good to hear. Two moons is normal, though, right? Um, the moons. Uh, yeah. Why don't you know about this stuff? You from like out of town or something? <laughs> oh shit! Did you hear that? I'm scared of the dark. Not really. Who touched my foot? Who touched my foot? Um, <laughs> <gasps> well, he's dead. Hey, Jesse. Jesse, come here. You've got a, a boy's name. What a dick. A <sighs> <laughs> rip asshole. <laughs> bye bye, bitch. Ah. Torque dog? Torque dog? So I'm guessing calling dibs on his inventory would be Ivor. Not classy. Got it, got it. <laughs> Jesse isn't just a boy's name. All those arrows. They're <laughs> like, okay. How did that? Who? One minute he's alive, the next gone. Poof. Sparkles, I know you're freaking out right now, but you've got to. Thank you for gifting me that game as well. By the way, Nova. I don't know if I said that. You're right. Everyone, stand back. Let me see what I can figure out. This is why is this happening? Gunpowder. You got a boy saying kicks him in the balls before he passes. And that's what you'd expect, I guess. <gasps> that's normal. You're not welcome. Oh, wow. There's the trap door that sucked up Torque Dog stuff. Looks His reaction like is so melodramatic. That arrow dispenser True. up there. But you saw his stuff. He didn't really have anything worth stealing. Perhaps it was simply to dispose of the evidence. 
I am so confused Guys, by this game. This game should have ended before. after episode four with you know fucking the shit with like Ruben. What do you make of it? Oh yes, I'm gonna shove that up my butt. Smells like yes. Potion of poison. Oh, is it a tip arrow? Oh, I've heard of those. They're they're still pretty new. Oh. Nasty stuff. Using potions to make arrows. The possibilities are fascinating. You say you know about these tipped arrows. Anything else you know that you're not telling us? Well, you're, you're not implying what I think you're implying, are you? Because I had nothing to do with this. Nothing. Could have uh -huh. sworn I saw someone doing a tutorial on how to make those not too long ago. My nerves are too shot to remember who right now. Uh huh. Well, let me know if it comes back to you. Hello? Everything okay in here? Whoa! What's with the crowd? I, uh, I was just about to get everyone together to tell them at once. Okay? There's something sketchy on going on. It's you! I recognize you! I recognize you! Excuse me? Uh, yes. What? Oh, really? Because I've never seen you in my life. I'll show you. Follow me. Um... Okay. <laughs> Lizzie, hi. Did you see all these new... Oh! I think I know what happened. I'm with you. <gasps> well, first it was the portraits of the people already here, then poof. You guys... Well, <coughs> that's unexpected. Yeah, no kidding. I'm like fucking ass. I know what's going to laugh to. I don't know what to fight. Well, not perfect. Absolutely perfect. I don't remember that quote. <laughs> he killed his bro because they're Must both in love with his redhead. Um, how well, they captured our likenesses. Some of us. Somebody's up to something. I don't know what yet, but I'm going to figure it it's out. It's Shrek Tom. Oh my god. Well, that's definitely not a good sign. Come on, everyone. <laughs> Let's huddle up in the dining room. Wonder if he told them yet. Can't wait to hear the big news. Me neither. Why else so oh, horny? This cake. None of us are horny. I don't yeah, know what you're talking about. Come on. Let's do this. Let's do this. <clears throat> I'm never horny. Here, let me introduce you all properly. <laughs> it's no nut. <laughs> Don't talk. Rose Jesus, 2020. Apparently, I can't talk tonight. This is Stacy Plays, Stampy Cat. We always horny. And that's Dan, the diamond minecart. <laughs> when did your hair change color? Wasn't it? It's funny. Before you guys showed up, we uh -huh. all knew each other here. Their names are Jesse, Petra, <laughs> Luna. Lucas, and Ivor. You said that was news? Is it good? Good news? Uh, yeah. It's, um, news, <laughs> what the fuck? I'm afraid. Torque Dog is dead. Good heavens. Oh, no. Wait, what? Oh, no. That so That's so convincing. Take him down? What happened? Yeah, what on earth is going on here, Sparkles? Well, this is going well so far. These are what got him. Tipped arrows? So is this what HH, -H -H, hot, horny, and hungry. <laughs> <Nasty>. <clears throat> I'm gonna start living by that motto. HHH, gone. Just like H -H -H, Triple H. So what happened to stuff? <laughs> Whoa, how can you say that? What? It's a valid question. Whoa. Hey, Nadine, how are you on, doing? Don't get greedy. Just, I want to know what happened. For curiosity's sake. His stuff just I like his English accent is Went huh? down this weird hole in the floor. Are we just supposed to take your word for that? Guys, I saw it too. Jesse was poking around in Torque Dog stuff right before it got sucked into a hopper. What the fuck? So I'm looking at this situation, I'm trying to figure something out. Is this just about Torque Dog, or is there a bigger picture? Yeah, why have our portraits? 
I don't know, guys. Knowing Top Dog, I think this might just be about him. Am I picking up uh -huh. some beef here? Uh, what? No! I don't know what you're talking about. There's something you're not telling me, Lizzie? Uh, no, sorry. Yeah, Lizzie. You know what? Forget I said anything. Well, someone brought us here for a reason, including Top Dog. What if we're all in danger? Oh my gosh, Dan's right! Whoever's doing this, they could be hunting us! Hunting us? Please, I'm not scared. Oh, they Torque Dog. I <laughs> they said Torque Dog. Oh my god. Yeah. That'd be better. Maybe we should try to be a bit more courageous here. That's the spirit. That's the spirit. Oh, all of this danger talk has my stomach all queasy. Stampy, come over here. I need to talk to you about something. Lizzie. Psst. Lizzie. The more I think about it, oh yeah, that's not that there's something obvious. These people really don't want us to know. One of them's got to know the truth about what's going on. Here. All of them know. It'd be nice to figure out what on earth is going on here, especially if we're going to be stuck with these people until dawn. Sounds like we've got a mystery to solve, people. Luckily, Detective Jesse. I could never pull that off. Let's get investigating then. I don't think it could ever even dye my hair a different color. Like, I could, obviously, but I don't think I could pull it off. Can I just leave? End of episode. End of game. Hey there, Dan. Lizzie. Oh, uh, hello? I'm never gonna remember all these names. If you don't mind, I actually had some <clears throat> questions about this torque dog situation. Yeah, go ahead. Good cop, bad cop time. Lizzie, seems like you're not much of a torque you know dog what I hate? fan. What do you That's hate? Oh come on, you met him, right? Nobody like that Wearing guy. Wearing a bra. Just the only one who will actually then don't wear one. It. He um yeah, he definitely wasn't the nicest person. It ain't required. <laughs> Same. Torque dog was clearly targeted with this trap. Why him? Well, he was bragging about having some kind of rare item. Wouldn't show it to anyone, of course. Typical talk dog. <laughs> Pan bras. So, this rare item that Tork Dog claimed to have, what can you tell me about it? We don't know exactly. Yeah, sorry. Let's do a bra okay. burning. <laughs> Everyone in the country just comes together, burns all the bras. Probably not a great time to get the whole it country like together, but really interested in seeing Tork Dog's inventory. Any idea why? An adventurer like him? He could have had all kinds of cool stuff. Uh-huh. Okay, that's it for now. Thanks. Yeah, you too guilty as fuck. It's all tangled up, but it sounds like Tork Dog claimed to have some sort of rare item. I didn't see anything like that in this points. Yeah, people like to waste yeah. points. Something's not quite adding up here. Just walk on over hey, here. Sparkles. And Cassie Rose, yeah? Yep, hi, that's me. Hey there, Jesse. Oh, Winslow says hi too. <laughs> hi, Winslow. The only one that I like out of this group. Nope. What are the questions? There was drama between Lizzie and Torque Dog, right? Got any insight? Sorry, I'm not getting wrapped up in that, especially now that Torque Dog is, you know. But it's weird, right? Definitely seems like there's some beef. Uh, not that I um, want to get into rumors or anything like that. Got any guesses why someone would kill Torque Dog? Oh, uh, gosh. Gosh. Um, he was a little. Here's the cat. Around the edges, you know? You'd have to the ask whole tone of this game changed. It really did. Mm-hmm. I don't want to say anything mean about a guy that's not here to defend himself, but well like, you met him, right? Oh, it's Frankly weird. Is kind of an Went from adventure to mystery drama. <laughs> Cassie, you seemed pretty upset about people wanting to poke around Torque Dog's inventory. Oh, was I? Yeah, yeah, you were. Why was that? Well, it was just so it's insensitive, right? Yeah. It, it, it had just happened, and she was all curious about what was in his pockets. Just made me mad, I guess. Sparkles. Made me so mad. Winslow. Thanks for the time. No problem. Bye, Winslow. Yeah, anytime. Get anything out of them? Found out this group. <laughs> and there's Nate in wasting points. Hell yeah. It's 
definitely something. Um, look at this. Can I just talk to Winslow? Like, can I pet him? Let me do something with him. There's a button there. Can't do anything with it though. Just because someone has a secret doesn't mean they're guilty. Could be hiding something else. Eh, they're guilty. Hey guys, Stampy and Stacy, right? Oh, oh, you can pet oh, me. Oh. Hey Jesse, what's up? I know things are a little nuts right now, but I've got some questions. Get it? Oh, little nuts. Really? Uh, what? Stacy, <coughs> you seem pretty curious about what was in Torque Dog's inventory. What's up with that? Well, Torque Dog was a pretty notorious thief. I was just curious what he had. That's it. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Anyone you can think of that would want something bad to happen to Torque Dog? Um, well. I never had that big of a problem with him personally. Was that but Birch? I know um, oh, quite a few actually. <laughs> Maybe. I don't know if you noticed, but he was a bit of a griefer. Yeah, and a thief. Thief, huh? Interesting. <coughs> Seems like Liz and Torque Dog really didn't like each other. Know anything else about that? Uh, oh, yep, it is. Real shame, real shame. He broke into her house and stole a bunch of stuff from her. She was super upset about it. You don't say. Thanks, you two. This has been enlightening. No problem. Yeah, no problem. He has a cute outfit. I want it. So Get did it. You find anything out from Stacy or Sturdy Cat? What's up, Stanky Kitty? Cat? Right, right. So did you find anything out? Apparently, Torque Dog was a well-known thief. A thief, huh? That might have something to do with Such it, a ring finger, kinky, clumsy. <laughs> so, Torque Dog was a thief, and he supposedly had something rare. But it feels like there's still a piece missing. No one will tell me what this rare item is. I, uh, I think I can shed some light on that situation, actually. Well, now my curiosity has peaked. He already had me at rare item. Of course he did. Why is everyone so secretive about this thing? What's the big deal? There's a temple, way out in the middle of nowhere. No one knows who built it, but it's been there forever. People have been trying to track down the temple's location for ages because they want this treasure. It's supposedly deep in its basement. Now, it looks just like an ordinary flint and steel, but it's actually super rare. It's got this enchantment on it. It can open portals to other worlds. Exactly. I have no but hands in it's what? weird. You know about the enchanted flint and steel. Only a little. How did you know that? I actually have one of my own. Really? Yeah, I do. Just used it a little while ago Jeez, to get put that away. You you can't just pull that out here. Okay. You know. I can I pull it out wherever I want to pull it out. And I, I think this might just prove it. Everyone? Everyone? We've all been freaking out, wondering why we were all brought here. Why uh, Torque Dog died? Uh, and Jesse that sounds just so a bad. A very important clue. <laughs> what? Really? I don't know what you're Whoever talking about. Dog, I think you're the only one here. They're after the enchanted flint and steel. Ah! Oh shit. Oh no, not again. Oh no, not again. Are we the killer? Greetings, adventurers. What the I fuck? I'm the white pumpkin. One of you is the treasure I desire. And will rest until it is mine. Even if I have to resort to murder. I'm too cute to die. <laughs> Oh no, not again. Me <laughs> when you turn into a werewolf. Terrible. Who was that guy? And there's no such thing as white pumpkins. So that's all of the white pumpkins hanging all over the place. Uh, uh, uh. I don't like it. I really don't like it. I actually saw him in the window when we first got I don't 
remember seeing that. I kind of recall it. Imagine if that was just like the whole episode. You go to a dinner party, just sit there at the table eating, and that's just the whole episode. Winslow! Wasn't that his name? I already forgot. That was so hard. Yeah, Winslow. So we're stuck in here. And if we're stuck in here, we're all doomed. As long as good food is served and get to eat it, I'm good with the bullshit. Oh, please don't bring that up Fair again. enough. Well, obviously Talk Dog didn't steal it. Okay, but who then? Uh, Jesse? <clears throat> what Lucas? <clears throat> They dead, son. Well, I guess I'm next then. Nope, not. It was a plush tendo. How you doing? Don't worry, Ivor. I'll protect you. I appreciate that, Jesse. I just hope that this white pumpkin isn't beyond both of our abilities. Well, I'm sure there's a perfectly logical explanation for how the white pumpkin is doing all this. I mean, the whole place has got to be rigged with traps, right? Torque dog, trap. Sparkles, trap. Yeah, we need to find out what makes these traps tick. Yeah, <laughs> this episode. This episode's fucking weird. All right, I'm going to investigate that dining room. Cool. I'll keep those guys in the hall for now so I can keep an eye on everyone. An excellent idea. Don't want them messing up the crime scene. I'm sticking with you, Jesse. Doesn't seem safe to wander off alone. Okay, people. Clear Just out. what I want. I want this Lucas and me. Scene. Yep. Okay. Can we just have How Ruben back? This, like... Oh, great. We'd get to investigate now. Yeah. Impressive. Anything? Nah. Looks like a regular old fireplace. How do you know that? Could be like a secret door behind it or something. You're really gonna walk all the way around. Oh my god. Okay, so this was the dining table where I'll we take the cap away. Right <laughs> oh look, that button I pointed out before. Okay, let's give this a shot. Just like before. Greetings, adventurers. I am the White Pumpkin. Yep. One of you just has like the before. treasure I desire. And my I guess is there's an enemy with a torch. <laughs> even if I have to resort to murder. I think it's Lucas. It's just I doubt it, a costume but. on an armor stand with a jukebox for a voice. No sign of how it was triggered. Wow. The white pumpkin so who is sitting in that seat skills to rig by the button like this? But why? It must have taken a lot of work to rig up. I think it could have been to throw us off the trail. Yeah, the voice actor is also good looking. Oh my god. Well, hopefully something else in here can shed a little more light on the situation. Jesse! Petra! He's back! The white pumpkin's back! Don't worry, everyone. It's just a dummy. A white pumpkin costume on an armor stand. Wait, what? Why? The trap that killed Sparkles. The whole show with the white pumpkin. It was all triggered by a button on the table. But what does that mean? I am so creeped out right now. Understandably. It means that the white pumpkin is... What are you doing, Alvin? He set up his whole Come house on. as a trap. And now, he's just watching us get <clears throat> snared in it. Wait, so you're saying that the white pumpkin is one of us? That's right, Mr. Stampy. One of us is a murderer. <laughs> really? And he sat right here. Wait, but that's not where Jesse found the Damn, found him six percent. I'll see if I can find all of them. Nice work, Jesse. 
Yes. Thanks. I must say I'm relieved to know that there's a damn lies. The stream elements is a bitch. No. Feels like we've made some good progress so far though, right? We need to figure out the most likely suspects and interrogate them. Judging by the tipped arrows and these traps, the damn 74. Serious chops in brewing and redstone. Reasonable. Okay, that's all of them. If you could all please take the same seat you were at before. Four of your seats are marked. These are the seats that had a button to activate the trap. That means that the white pumpkin could only be Dan, Stampy, Lizzie, or Lucas. Wait, you're accusing us? <coughs> what? I echo their sentiments exactly. I didn't even see a button. Me neither. This is crazy. Hey, 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 I'm not accusing anyone. Can I make Look, Winslow it my sure cat? Sounds like you're accusing us, it's Lizzie. <laughs> I don't care for it. I'm taking charge now. Kind of what I'm thinking. I'm going to get to the bottom of this. I want everyone Idea separate. for new story, cat boy and dog boy get together. Oh my god. One by one, so I can find out who's telling the truth and who's lying. I've got a whole lot of questions, and I want nothing. The fuck is this game? For each and every cat dog boy. <laughs> Understand Alvin, me. loud and clear. Go. Yes, crystal clear. Don't get into Who that. Are you gonna interrogate first? <clears throat> Dap boy. I am gonna talk. I'm not gonna talk to Lizzie first. I'm gonna talk to Stampy. Stampy cat. What? My ghost. <laughs> Should I play the furry game? Why not? I'm telling you, this is just crazy. Absolutely crazy. Total misunderstanding. Got to sit <laughs> Sit down, I Stampy. I don't even want that flint and steel thingy. Not um, as much as the others at any rate. Mm-hmm. Did I hear someone saying that it has something to do with portals? I don't have any interest in portals. No, sir. Not for old Mr. Stampy Cat, thank you. It's me, Stampy. Everyone's friend. I gotta say, Stampy, you seem <sighs> nervous. Everything okay? You comfortable? Um, what? No, I'm not nervous. No, nope, totally comfortable. I could fall asleep right the here. The weirdest part of this game is a uh, voice actor for male Jesse Please is a voice actor for the rat in the know. best Pixar movie. Ratatouille? Is that the one you're talking about? Okay, enough dancing around. Who do you think took the flint and steel? That's only like rat I movie I can think of. Stolen. Oh? Yeah, so Dan got it ahead of Lizzie, right? And she was pretty angry about Damn, it. Damn, I should have picked him. I think he made up that story about it being stolen, so she'd think he didn't have it anymore. Classic Dan move. Know anything about this? Oh, wow. <laughs> Looks so that? wrong. Some sort of magic arrow? No, I've never seen anything like it before. Honest, you know who would love to see something like that though? Lizzie. She's wild about potions and brewing and all of that. She's way better with that stuff than I am. Good with potions, you say? Very good. Could probably even teach a class. <laughs> what do you know about redstone? What's your skill level with the stuff? Oh, well, you know, about average, it all. average level moderate I, I don't know how these things are graded these days i know that dan's been getting really into the stuff lately though just putting that out there in case you're curious dan's interested in redstone huh interesting you're excused stampy thank you for your time oh thank goodness this room is making me very nervous <clears throat> he's totally me at an interview Who's <laughs> same Let's talk. Um, let's talk to Lizzie. Lizzie. Right. Jesse, listen. There's been a lot of talk thrown around today. I don't know what people have told you. I don't know what you believe. But I'll just admit it. 
I want that enchanted flint and steel as much as anyone. Probably more than any of them. I've been searching for it for years. Do you know how much it's stung to have Dan? Dan! Yeah. Swoop in and take it from under my nose. Hang on. I thought you said you found it. Well, I as good as found it. I did the research, I did the studying, I was all prepared to go in there and finally get it when that little goggle-wearing goon swept in and stole it first. Listen, uh -huh. I just want to get out of here and get on with my day. What do you have to hear to be convinced that the white pumpkin isn't me? I'm just going to be straight. <coughs> Who do you think stole the flint and steel? Well, it wasn't me, if you're curious. Uh -huh. If I had an enchanted flint and steel, I'd be off exploring some other world with it. Between you and me, though, I think Dan's whole story about it being stolen from him is a load of trash. I, I knew she was going to throw Dan under the bus, sir. Know what this is? Tipped arrow. Kind of shoddy work, though. Definitely not one of mine, if that's what you're wondering. Some noob made that thing. Seems like what a something noob. Dan might cobble together, though. Plus, I taught Cassie and Stacy how to make those a while back. This is a conspiracy. Do you like using redstone? Ever make traps with the stuff? I'm fine, I guess. Lights, doors, that sort of thing. Dan was always way better than I was, though. You wouldn't believe some of the stuff I've seen that guy build. Crazy conveyor belts, hopper systems. I think it's Lizzie no and Stampy. Thanks for your time, They're Lizzie. both trying to throw this Thank Dan you. guy under the bus too much. They're in it on to, with Are each other. Down? Yeah, send him in. Hey, I, I don't know what the other's been saying, but you, you have to listen. I'm telling you, you've got the wrong guy. Honest. I would never hurt anyone. You've got to believe me. If anyone's been wronged here, it's me. That you know, is what everyone's talking about. I found that. That's mine. At least it was before someone stole it. And now everything's gone completely crazy. People getting caught in horrible traps. Everyone accusing and blaming each other. That's why you invited everyone here, huh? To find out who stole it. What? No, 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 no. I didn't invite anyone. That's not what's going on. I was invited here, same as everyone else. Uh-huh. I'm not the White Pumpkin. You've got to believe me. What can I tell you to convince you? Mm. Know anything about this? Oh, he looks wow. like part uh, of a uh, British boy band. He does. No? Tipped arrows not ringing a bell? Made using potions. Nuh-uh, but you want to know about stuff with potions? I'll ask Lizzie. She's way better with that stuff than I am. I always go to her with potion questions. Yeah, it sounds a little familiar to me. Out with it. Who stole the flint and steel? I... I, I don't know. I don't know anything about it. And you just expect me to believe that? Seems to me that your name's been coming up connected to that flint and steel a lot today. Just come clean with me. You're the white pumpkin, aren't you? Whoa, 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 whoa. No way. Not me. That's just not true. You have to believe you want me. your enchanted flint and steel back, and you built this whole... I honestly don't think it's do him. I wouldn't know how. Honest. So, how would you rate your redstone knowledge? Me? <clears throat> not much. Not really my scene. You want to know more about that stuff? You should ask Stampy. He was the Tribop champion. Mm -hmm. You can go now, Dan. Thanks, Jesse. Thank you. Oh, come on! This is nuts! You had a button, too! Fair's fair. It's your buddy's turn next. <laughs> it's not fucking Lucas. Hey, Jesse. Ah, uh, my final suspect. Here to point more fingers and blame more people, I'm sure. I didn't push the button, you know. I figured. Law and Order Minecraft Edition. <laughs> just non-stop whispering and rumors out there. Perfect. You Petra and Ivor pretty much been sticking to ourselves. So hard to say. Alvin, I mean, what are you doing? Throwing each other on the minecart tracks. It's like they're all guilty. Well, if there's one person who can untangle it, it's you. <laughs> Thanks, Lucas. Come on, suspect. It's time to return to the others. We should still interrogate him. So, have you decided? Depending on what order you pick them, they all throw each other under a bus. I figured that's kind of how it worked out. I want to thank everyone for answering my questions. 
There's still not 100% proof of anyone, but... But... Yes. Where are your suspicions, Lady Jesse? Oh, boy. Jesse was definitely questioning Stampy the longest. What? <laughs> Dan was in there way longer. Hey, not cool. Guys, guys, come on. Uh, do I accuse someone? Right now, evidence seems to point to Lizzie. What? No way. She's the only one I was talking to who had any idea about the tipped arrows that were used to kill Torque Dog. Oh, come on, guys. You can't really be Daniel doing this. Daniel Middleton, apparently. I vote we lock her back up mm, in the library. Doesn't sound familiar to me. I fully endorse this plan. Sorry, Lizzie, but we can't take any chances no, here. Guys, you know me. I'm no killer. I'm not the white pumpkin. Well... That was certainly some excitement. Yeah, no kidding. What if it's Ivor? I mean, this is a very Ivor thing to do. Traps. We need to figure out how these things work. Like, we know that the sparkles trap was triggered by those buttons under the table. But what about the trap that turned Torque Dog into a pincushion? If we figure out how these things work, we might be able to find more proof about who the White Pumpkin is, how they're operating. I'm not sure. But the White Pumpkin didn't trigger it until Torque Dog was in the exact right spot. That means he must have been watching from somewhere. Creepy. Yes. Seems like it might be worth our while to poke around the kitchen. You guys go on ahead. I'm gonna stay here, keep an eye on these other people. I don't want them trying anything when we're not looking. Thanks, Lucas. <laughs> Lucas is gonna, gonna get Back fucked up, isn't he? So, what are we looking for exactly? Buttons like back in the dining room. There are too many loose ends flying around. He's outside when we saw the white bubble through the window. Mm. We need to find some definitive concrete evidence. Got it. I'm on the lookout. Uh, let's take a look at this creeper painting. Wish I could get fucked up. Have eye holes? Oh, yeah. How would I not notice that before? Seems worth taking a closer inspection. Punch it. Okay. Oh. Well, what do we got here? It's some sort of secret passageway. That's like a death room, isn't lever. it? Gonna pull that lever and like a bunch of spikes and gonna start coming down from the ceiling. Some Resident Evil shit. Okay, everyone. Make sure you're nowhere near that arrow trap. Oh, look at that. <laughs> More of those mm -hmm. pollution covered arrows. Nasty. Well, seems like we found out how the white pumpkin killed Torque Dog. Yeah, and <coughs> he's getting around the house. I assume we're investigating the creepy passageway? I think we've come too far to turn around now. Well, it's fine. After you then. I feel like I'm just watching a movie. <laughs> Lizzie's okay locked up in the library. We get to walk <laughs> around for like five seconds and then it's just <laughs> what if there are more picking an option. There? Unless Lizzie is the white pumpkin. Lizzie, they're gonna go through Christine yeah. novel. Yeah, I guess. I just hope we find what we're looking for. Oh shit. Another one of these. Probably another painting or something. With a couple eye holes poked in it. The amount of redstone wiring that must be hidden in this place. Amazing! I'm guessing that must <clears throat> activate another trap. Maybe one that's visible through that peephole? <laughs> See anything that this lever might be connected to? What do we got here? What do you see? <laughs> That'd be so creepy. It's the library. I can see Lizzie locked up in there. 
I remember walking around a creepy mansion a lot better when it was called Luigi's Mansion. <laughs> Hell yeah. Ooh. Hey, I have to speak to you. Dan, what? How'd you get in here? I snuck in past that blonde guy. Uh, Lucas? But I have to speak to you. It's really important. Dan, slow down. What are you saying? It was me. I killed Sparkles. Dan, you're the white pumpkin? Oh, what? No, 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 no. I swear, it was an accident. Oh, shit. I just... I don't understand. How could it be an accident? I swear, I had no idea. There was this button. I'm not going to buttons. I had to push it. I had no idea what it would do. The white now pumpkin! I feel awful. He's in there! You'll have to let's go kick his me butt. when I say it's a little hard to believe. Let's fuck him up. I know, I know. It sounds ridiculous. I've been beating myself up about it ever since it happened. <laughs> what? What on earth? Oh shit. Nah, it's just a few spiders, it's fine. What's going on? The door's locked, Jesse! Spiders! They're everywhere! Okay, I'll see if I can get in another way. Mmm. What in the <laughs> Jumanji? Oh my god. Hey, buddy! Hey, buddy! Hey, buddy. Ah, uh, Lizzie's getting fucked up. Ah, uh, Lizzie's dead. Enjoying the party. <laughs> you want to fight, bro? Bring it. You don't know who the fuck I am. Reminds me of Scarecrow. Oh shit. Nope. I'm dead. Try to keep up. Oh shit. Run, Jesse. You better start jumping. Your luck's about to run out. Oh, what a dick. Come on, why do you keep stopping? Oh, I missed that. Lucas is about to die. <laughs> Lucas? What the fuck? Jesse. Lucas? Hey. Give me a moment. I'm trying to figure this one out myself. Lucas, I thought you were chasing the white pumpkin. Uh, yeah, I was, and I almost had him until, you know, he took me by surprise and stuck this pumpkin on my head. Well, what's going on in here? No! <gasps> you called the white pumpkin! Grab him, quick! On it! Oh my god. Get out of our way, Jesse. Yeah, it's all out in the open now. You can't defend your friend anymore. No, no, no. I know what's going on here, and I won't stand for it. One of you is still the White Pumpkin, and you're trying to pin it on Lucas. Yeah, bold words. Especially coming from someone with a knack for locking up innocent people. It's the facts, Jesse. These horrible things only started happening Just shove when that in his ass. arrived. And now, Lizzie is gone too. I say we throw him outside and let nature take its course. What? Out, outside, outside? I say I kill you and take a cat. No, you can't do that. 
Yeah, uh, I don't know. I still have my suspicions about Lucas, but Jesse did save me. I don't feel right about chucking your friend to the zombies. Hm. Brave stance. Man, at least you're reasonable. Yeah, unlike some of these people. Damn. Fine. Thank you. Don't go celebrating yet. We've still got to do something with this <sighs> not roaming around freely. What? Like lock me up in a closet or something? There was a closet in the main hall with a lovely metal door. Seems like a perfect place to lock someone up. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> I was mostly joking. I guess that's fair. But I'm keeping guard because I still don't trust him. I don't trust you, bitch. Is that cool with everyone? Yeah. That's funny. Because I don't trust you. It's fine, Jesse. I'll watch over Lucas. Awesome. <laughs> Come on, Cassie. But don't go getting any funny ideas, blonde guy. This isn't because I like you or anything. No, of course not. Be quiet. Prisoners aren't supposed to talk. Don't <laughs> put me back in the closet. Okay. Well, what are we supposed to do now? We need to figure out how we're going to clear Lucas's um... name. And I'd like to do it sooner rather than later. Seems like some of these people are getting a little stir crazy. The white pumpkin must have a, I don't know, a lair or a base of operations or something in this house. We need to find it. I still don't understand like why they think it's Lucas when he was looking after them and uh, while the white pumpkin was in the other room, right? Like, uh oh. There's not much logic in this game. We're just gonna sit here looking at paintings. Okay. Hmm. Mm. Hmm. Can we talk to her? What do you want? Don't you fucking get pissy with me. Lucas. Seems a little suspicious. Not nearly as suspicious as Lucas. Where were you when I was chasing the white pumpkin? Making cookies. I get a sweet tooth when I'm nervous. Uh huh. Don't go anywhere, Stacy. <sighs> sure. Oh wait, we can punch that. <laughs> Whoa! Another secret passage. Well, what did you expect? <laughs> She's like, what the fuck? Well, this looks promising. And again, it just makes sense how two of them slipped out of the room while Lucas is watching them. So <laughs> true. Is this some type of like puzzle shit? Seems like a step in the right direction. Hmm, yeah, that seems right. Does it? <laughs> I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. There we go. Awesome. Okay. I literally just guessed at that, but. Oh, wow! You got it open! Yeah, you guys should stay here. Could be dangerous. No, I totally want to follow you into your friend's creepy secret passageways. Ugh, seriously? You really think Lucas did it? You haven't it? proven that he didn't yet. Technically true. Hey, come on, cool it. We're all in this together, aren't we? Depends. Figured you'd be on your little buddy's side. Ugh. You know what, dude? You know dude? what? They're not worth it. Because a puzzle who died first last. Ah, interesting. Wow. Deep. Guess it leads down to whatever the white pumpkin calls home. I wonder how he gets down there. Maybe in addition to walking through walls, he can fly for all we know. I'm proven, oh. I'm innocent until proven guilty, right? Like it's what the just, fuck? I'm really worried about Lucas. Those Lucas will be fine. Safe, the white pumpkin is still running around, and he could strike again at any minute. Not to mention, all those people back there have been so ungrateful, so petty. Petra, don't worry. We're going to stop the White Pumpkin way before he can hurt anyone else. You sure about that? It's gonna be fine. You're right. I know you're right. 
<sighs> Sorry, Jesse. I just really needed to get that off my chest. We're gonna get through this. Let's start by figuring out how we're gonna get down there, huh? You know the drill. What have you got in your inventory? Didn't you have all those wood blocks? Sorry, I was whittling earlier. Nervous habit. Well, luckily, those should do just the trick. Yay, we get to craft. Yeah, I get to play the game. <laughs> you thinking ladder? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Gonna need a lot of them. I'll race you. Oh, God. <laughs> You're on. What am I doing? I don't know the recipe for this shit. Fuck. I got to do this for every single one. Oh man. <laughs> Thanks. I needed that. All right, we've got a lot more of these to make. Oh god. Let's Please tell me this is just going to be okay. <laughs> I was going to be quite annoyed if I had to sit there doing each one. Okay, that's one down. Lots more to go. <sighs> See? Told you we'd make it. Yeah, I just hope this works. I think we're gonna find the white pumpkin down here? With all these secret passageways? <laughs> He's it's upstairs so with the fight. It's hard to tell where he might be. I'll be honest. I hope we do. And this time, he's not walking away with just a scar on his mask. Brutal. I like it. Hey, do you hear? Lots oh, and lots shit. of zombies? Yeah, I do. It's fine. Zombies ain't <laughs> shit in this game. Ugh, ditto. Gross. Zombie noises. Sorry. What in the world is that? <gasps> Whoa. Some sort of like zombie spawner. Does that mean the white pumpkin actually made the sea of zombies outside? Minecraft, the walking like. dead. I have no idea what that is because I don't know shit about Minecraft. Uh, come on. I think this is where people's stuff goes after those hoppers upstairs suck it up. <laughs> they all right. jamming and head banging. <laughs> Lizzie's. Okay, but where's the loot going from here? Hopefully. Why is Twitch pumpkin. being so fucking stupid right now? Hey, you see the light coming out of that tunnel too, right? Huh? Oh, yeah. And it doesn't look like it's blocked off like all the, uh, zombie-filled ones. If we can get up there, I think we might be able to follow the loot to wherever it's going. Well, that's awesome. Nice find. How do you want to Thanks. get Thanks. Grab some dirt, Petra. We're going climbing. Yay, it's dirt time. My favorite time. Okay, I think we can jump from here. Embarrassing. Thanks, Jesse. No problem. What the fuck is this game? <laughs> huh? Weird. That almost. 
almost sounds like I knew it was a cat. Whoa. Oh shit. It's just some sort of growing station. Weird. Light pumpkin must have heard us. Stampy cat? Boy, you gave me a fright. What are you doing down here? What are we doing down here? Yes, it looks terribly suspicious, you know. Looks like we're catching you in the act, White Pumpkin. No, no mm -hmm. not me. That's not me. I was just curious. Come on, you guys. I can't be the White Pumpkin. I'm Stampy Cat. I'm no murderer. Huh? Uh huh. I needed to find you because I have something important to tell you. I have something to confess. Something I haven't told anyone. Where is this going? What? Why is this game like glitching out like that? <laughs> I stole it from Dan. It was just supposed to be a joke, a harmless prank. But then, well, you've seen what happened. Wow. Who would have thought? I knew people wanted it, but I had no idea that that this would happen. Wow. Stampy cat with the enchanted flint and steel. Didn't see that one coming. Definitely suspicious. I know, and that's why I had to keep it a secret. I may be a thief, but I'm no killer. But that white pumpkin is, and he's killing people for it. And now we're down in his lair. I was thinking maybe I should just give it to the white pumpkin. What? Just maybe that would make it all stop, right? Maybe? First, we need to figure out who this white pumpkin really is. Then we'll figure out what to do from there. I... I suppose that's a better strategy. Where the fuck is this cat? That looks like a lair door if I ever saw one. Part of the way these characters move are so awkward sometimes. Sometimes? More like, like most of the time. Stampy is meowing. Creepy. I would not put this in my top ten places I've ever been. Well, there's where the meowing's coming from. Don't worry. We'll get out of here as soon as we find something that proves the white pumpkin's identity. He is a cat boy, true. Uh, let's see. Let's see here. Legends Hi, of the world portals. Basic portal theory, portals and you. Wow, they're all about What's up, portals. Bud? It's pretty obsessive. Hey, what you want to come up? No, okay. Petra, did you see this? That's the portal hallway. Yeah. Alvin hype. Looks like the white pumpkin's been there too. Can I punch this one? Here's where everyone's stuff gets collected. Alvin! <sighs> Those poor people. Fucking Alvin. That's the solution to everything. It's not a horrible solution. You guys doing okay? I'll be honest with you. Alvin! About Lucas. If the white pumpkin isn't down here, he must still be upstairs. And I thought that I was okay because it's I was the time sent her to the room. Yay! Look, I'm beginning to suspect it was actually Finally, shot. now Don't I can hear. Welcome back, body. Luna. It's good to have you here. I'm guessing this chest should have it. Yep, we've got sticks. Anything else? Oh, wow. And ender pearls. Sweet. That must have been how the white pumpkin got down that elevator shaft. Looks like a typical brewing stick. 
Oh boy, I don't think I'm going to be able to do three episodes of this tonight. Oh, yeah. Yeah, she did. I thought I might be able to, but... There's nothing I can crack. Oh. Not yet, anyway. This is a long episode. I mean, it's not even, like, too long. We're only, like, an hour and 15 minutes in right now. But it's, like... Oh. Okay, kitty, kitty. Can you scoot out of the way, please? I need to get in the chest. Really? No, bad kitty! Ah, stupid cats. Need something to distract it if I'm going to get that chest open. Should be able to get some string from those cobwebs. It'll go perfectly. I think it's gonna be this chest. fucking Cassie chick, the redhead. I swear Cassie did that on purpose. Oh yeah. That one of those would convince that cat to get off the chest. But how am I going to catch one? Um. Oh, look at that. Trying to figure out how many gift cards I need to get, and then gonna buy the children from the other campus a small tour to so the moms don't have to use the gift cards on them. There you go, Luna. Come on, kitty. I'm sure you'll figure it all out. You're interfering with my investigation. Perhaps it would leave if you gave it some sort of delicious treat. Where am I going to get something like that? But that is really nice of you. Okay, what are we doing? Cut. That, 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 and that. Yay! Such a Minecraft pro. Oh, <laughs> Gotta eat some fucking it. recipes. Yeah, and I saw one in the pond that'll be perfect. Let's go fishing. Gotta get the kitty cats a treat. There we go. Wow, nice catch, Jesse. Thanks. Thanks. I bet that cat'll love this. fishing. Is just that easy. <laughs> cat boy wants fish. Here you go, cat boy. Um, there we go. Okay, here, kitty. Get the fishy. There you go. Jeez. Beer and beer. Calling already, wifey. Give me the creeps. No offense. Why? None taken. I'm not really a cat. Cats are awesome. At least I can finally get in here now. He's not really a cat. Damn. Portraits. Loads of them. Okay. Oh, I don't like that. I guess he already had all the X'd out ones ready to go. Yep. More so cats than my grandmother. Has. <laughs> Stampy Lucas Ivor and hey. There's me. But what does it all mean? The cats, the crossed out portraits. Yeah, the portraits. There was one person who didn't have a crossed out portrait. Someone who's a known cat person. Mm hmm. Okay. So who did it? Yes, you figured it out? The white pumpkin is Cassie Rose. She's the murderer. Oh shit. Oh man. You're totally right. I don't believe it. Uh, not only is she the white pumpkin, but she owns way, way too many cats. Well, come on, you guys. It's time to They all look innocence. alike. What the fuck? You know, change it up a bit. <clears throat> I'll go round everyone up. On? Yeah, you were gone an awful long time. What's going on here? Did you even find anything? I have the evidence I need to prove that Lucas is innocent. Oh, really? 
<laughs> she oh, on Stampy. <laughs> What is this music? Are you going to tell them, or should I just do it? Uh, I don't know what you're talking about. Jesse, go on. Is this going where I think this is going? The white pumpkin is Cassie Rose. She's the murderer. <laughs> That's impossible. No way. No way. Yeah, Jesse, I'm afraid you're going to have to do better than that. Look at the facts. We caught Lucas with that pumpkin head right after mm -hmm. Cornelius got taken out. I think you're just lying to protect him. Cassie's making a lot of sense right now. Do you have any? Oh, shut to back up. You up. There's something that's been bothering me for a while now. Something that happened in the Great Hall shortly after Torque Dog was hit with that trap. What's that? Go on, Jesse. You've got this. Where is this going? Shh. Let Jesse mm. finish. Cassie said she recognized us, even before we saw the portraits. Uh, actually, that was Lizzie. Oh, shoot. Fuck. <laughs> I misremembered that. Well, no matter. I haven't even gotten to the really juicy stuff oh, God. that came next. Mm, plus, we thank you for the, the, for the follow. I can't talk. Jesus. Items. items for the White Pumpkin's evening festivities. And there was one very significant detail. What was this evidence? Shh. I think Jesse's about to tell everyone. The White Pumpkin had portraits all ready to go, pre-exed out. One for each of us. Except for Cassie. <gasps> Ooh, that's good. <laughs> okay, I think they're on the fence, but you can do this. Bring it home, okay? <laughs> Thanks, Petra. That was the last piece of evidence, dear friends, that helped me really figure out who we were dealing with here. Cats. Dozens of calico cats. And they all looked just like Winslow. An amusing story, Jesse. But if you saw all these I move for a vote of no confidence. Time, then what color is Winslow? It shouldn't be a problem if you saw a hundred cats? Really? Oh shit. <laughs> um What the fuck color is he? Like I know he's orange and something. I'm like watching my stream to figure this out. Orange, black, and white. Okay. Black, white, orange. Winslow is black, white, and orange. Cassie, is this all true? This whole thing has been about your crazy scheme to get a portal key, hasn't it? Killing whoever gets in your way. How very clever, Jesse. Well, I guess that's it then. You caught me. I am the murderer. Wow. I, <laughs> I know. I was shocked too. I'm relieved, but also surprised. But what did any of us ever do to you? Directly? Nothing. But you idiots had the one thing that I most desperately needed. I've been stuck in this stupid world with its stupid two moons for years! Trapped with a portal right under my nose, but no key to open it. That is, until I finally heard that this world's portal key had been found. I knew it was one of you. So I tried my best to earn your friendship, figure out who had it. Cassie, how could you? We shared cookies together. Cookies! You really think that's an excuse? You're pathetic, Cassie. It doesn't excuse all yeah, the actually, horrible things you've done. Yeah, I should have mad if you had this right because Sampy would just goof up and say so little flint and steel. I still wanted to get it right. Cassie Rose. I vote we build an obsidian prison and surround it with lava. No, 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 no. I won't let you do that. Damn, I Stampy. Can't. No! This is your fault! You did this to me! We shared cookies together. Stop. I'll fight all of you! Fuck her up! And every one of you! Oh shit. <laughs> we need to dig her out. After everyone she's hurt, she can dig herself out. She did terrible things, but no one deserves this. <sighs> she did it to <sighs> Wait, look. I can't believe it. She's gone. What a way to go. 
Yeah, I guess I'll Poor Cassie. Out, <laughs> you can't really say that to not helping. Wow. Wow. The trapper taken out by one of her own traps. That's ironic. If only she they say no one deserves that, but she did the same shit to thing. like the other people. Hey, <laughs> it's morning. I guess I guess that's it then. Yeah, we're free. And we're alive. It's not wasted standing around. There could still be traps everywhere in here. Bye, Felicia. Imagine that. Like, there's actually a zombie apocalypse one day, like, in real life. But during the daytime, they'd all burn to death. Like that. That'd be weird. Talk dog, sparkles, Lizzie, and Cassie, I guess. Uh, that's a good point. Yeah, I didn't mean to depress anyone. I just can't stop thinking about them. I tried my hardest, but there was nothing I could do. Oh, we all know that, Jesse. Tried it's not so your fault. hard Lucky for us, and got so far. But in the I end, have no idea it doesn't begin finding our matter. Well, Cassie said it was right under her nose, right? That's true. Maybe it's nearby. I feel kind of bad for Captain Sparkles since he died really early on and you had no option to save him and like Dan Lizzie. True. Hey, what do you know? There it is. A fabulous coincidence. What is with that glitching? <laughs> so, I guess this is goodbye, huh? Bye. Yeah. Just let us know if you ever accidentally find yourselves in our world. <laughs> That's really nice of you, but I don't think we can really portal hop without a portal key. I'm gonna like that oh, boy's well, being sus. <laughs> They're all pretty fucking sus. You stole the portal key from me? It was just meant to be a prank. A harm. Shadow. Prank. I'm so sorry. So very, very sorry. Yeah, come on. It's Stampy. You know he would never actually try to hurt anyone. And so. The drama continues. Fascinating. <laughs> hey, it's cool, guys. You can share it. Make like your own order of the stone. Yeah. It right. still blows my mind that Ivor well, is Pee Wee Herman. Goodbyes, so I'm actually just gonna start walking home. Thanks for everything. Still yeah, blows my too. mind. Travel safe, you guys. Bye. What? A strange, strange bunch of individuals. Cassie, what's her name? She got followed by for her name, Shadow Wolf. The world. What if she was one of the there you go, Night Wolf. Portal keys, other worlds. It all adds up, I guess. I know. Man, that's too bad if it is true. Seeing as how she turned out to be, you know. A white pumpkin and all. Yes. Hadn't thought about that. I just can't believe that we finally met someone who might be an old builder, and she's a pumpkin wearing serial killer. Typical. <laughs> well, here we Typical. are. Typical. Would you care to do the honors, Jesse? Huh? Oh, shit. That's weird. Winslow. That's strange. I thought. <laughs> Fucking cat. No! I swear to the pumpkin killer. <laughs> what happened? I can't see a thing. Well, that's. Ominous. Do you hear that? Oh shit. And your mites. And there it is, Jesse. You're trapped. Stuck. Oh, what a bitch. <laughs> Just like I've been in this rotten world. Ah, please. I've gotten out of way worse than this, Cassie. <laughs> I admire your bravado. 
I don't know how much time you've spent with Endermites, but the poor things are eternally hungry. I would throw the flint and steel up here before I drop you down to find out how sharp their teeth are. Uh, guys, I dropped the flint and steel when we fell. I have no idea where it went. <laughs> tick tock, tick tock, Jesse. What's it gonna be? The flint and steel? Or your lives? Just give me the flint and steel and I'll let you go free. I don't believe her. Just because I hate this place doesn't mean it's so bad. Okay, you're right. You win. We'll give you the flint and steel. But let us out first. Totally no, I'm not falling for that one. <laughs> nope, this is taking too long. I'm so I'll fucking hungry right, right now. You and fish it out of your inventory. It'll be the best fishing trip ever. <gasps> Wings for my pet. Activate the trap. Want something done right, Jackin? Prepare for your death! <laughs> oh, oh shy. Uh, uh, stupid door! Come on. It's no use! Without a lever or button, we'll never get these iron doors open. Welcome Just back, wifey. On, guys. I'm gonna get up to the control panel. Yeah. It took a while. Is... It's all right. Pull that shit. Uh, it just started going faster. She booby trapped her booby traps. That is so terrible. Wow. What? You thought you could do it just like that? Trying to get leverage. Fuck you, Cassie. Give me my key, Jesse. Ah! Guys? No! No! Hey, Jesse. Guys, I can't believe you're alive. Thank goodness. Yeah, for now. Don't worry. I'm doctor's appointment tomorrow. Oh, Throw boy. Throw it down. Okay, get ready. I hope it goes well, Nightwolf. Got it. Okay, you guys get to safety. I need Doctor's to find appointments are never a fun time. You're not a fast learner, are you? I grow tired of this game, Jesse. The okay. king, you didn't have it either. Oh no, it's mine. Nope. No. Oh, what the fuck? No, we are going home. Oh shit. I just don't see you have a high blood pressure. Uh, come on. Oh shit. No, no, Winslow! Don't touch that! <laughs> Fucking cat. No, 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 Winslow! Bad kitty, stop it! Winslow! Good boy, it's sweet kitty! Bring that to master! Here, kitty kitty! Here, kitty kitty! Don't do it! No! <laughs> you dick! No! 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 <laughs> ah, there yeah. you are! After all this time, I'm free! Winslow, we have to go! What have I told you about wandering off? I think you should give that back, Kathy! No, I'm afraid not. I'll give you one thing. You are incredibly tenacious! <laughs> <laughs> That's never act, Jesse. It stays on fire forever. Well, Winslow, that's the last of the obstacles. We're finally going home. <laughs> Come on, Winslow. Winslow, Winslow, come on. Dove, oh, I love it. You know I love you, but you're very tired sometimes. 
Red Pumpkin! Yes, Jesse? Just wanted to get your attention. I don't know what you're playing at, but I'm bored with it. No! Ah! Oh, shit. Fuck her up. Ah! What's going... Ah! I've got it! Excellent! I did it! You're all dying now! Uh, no, thank you! Got it! Pee-wee no! <laughs> <laughs> has a keep up. Well, Jesse, I bet you're real proud of yourself. Look at me, stuck again, out of Ender Pearls. And that's where she wanted us to end up. It really did blow my mind that Pee-wee Harden <laughs> does that voice. <laughs> You got what you deserve, Cassie. You've been ruthless and selfish and mean, and this is where it gets you. Wait. At least don't leave me here all alone. Give me my cat. My dear sweet Winslow. Fuck you. He's my best, my only friend. Please. Can we take him with us? Like. Winslow? Winslow! Where are you, my darling? Come to Master, please! I have a fish! Come get the fishy! Winslow? Winslow! Wow. So Bring him with us. Real I want Winslow. Down here all this time. Unless this one is a trap, too. I don't know if even she'd be that paranoid. Only one way to find out. Wow. So far. Yeah. No trick floors or arrows or anything. Okay, sure. But who's going first? We're a team. We all go together. Ready? One, two, two three. three. Adventure! Paul Rubens does a really good job in this game of Zyde 4. He does. He does. If I didn't look it up last episode, I wouldn't have known right, so everything of him. Is, it's me, Captain Sparkles, next time on Minecraft Story Mode. After defeating the dreaded White Pumpkin, will Jesse and the others find their way back to the portal hallway? And will it lead them home? Or instead, are they destined for more perilous adventures? Well, I guess I'll never know because I got pounded into the ground by a ton of sand. <laughs> I guess you saw that, right? I'm in the middle of an amazing speech, and boom! I've suddenly become part of the floor. I mean, dude, you saw that, right? How much worse can it get? First, they choose not to invite me on their adventure, and the next thing I know, I'm part of the floor. Anyway, one thing's for certain. Even without me, this is going to be an amazing adventure. Still drives me nuts. I can't see the choices. <laughs> He's salty. <laughs> Alvin? Episode 6 A Portal to Mystery. Oh boy. That's a pretty weird episode. I'm just so confused of this game. I mean. From like the beginning to episode four, like is all connected. Now it's just like a different story every episode, and oh, it's weird. The episode was kind of slow. I can't stop yawning. I'm so hungry. What time is it? 1.30. So it's too late for me to order anything. I might just grab like a snack or something. I could cook something. Throw something in the air fryer.
I skip this? Okay, there we 